Hello. Welcome to the first video of Table Production. My name is Sad Jimbabazi. Here with Havinaza Michel. We are trainers at Tirunja Tifet School. We are going to have three videos about the process of producing a table. Let's begin with preparation of pieces for making a table. Enjoy the lesson. Hello everyone, my name is Habima Ngabire Devota, a carpentry trainer at Rubenjira TV at school. Today we have a session about basic funds of making a table. The objectives of this session is that at the end, a runner will be able to select where timber. The second one is that a runner will be able to produce where the pieces or material to be used. I encourage you to follow well and take some notes because you will need them in the coming time. The parts of the table are top, side or plan, and you have the bottom. After designing a project, the following is to select material for making that project. For us, we decided to use wood, and that's why we are going to select timber to be used. In selecting timber, we have to focus on kind of timber we are going to use and to check if the timber are well dried and if timber are free from knot defect and free from insect attack and free from spread. While measuring timber, if are well dried, we have to use hydrometer and also we have to check if timber are having good dimension so that we can get all measurement we need. You have to check if timber are having required dimension. After the selection of timber, the following is to make wood catalog and to prepare pieces. In preparing pieces, we will need trim saw, we will need surface planer, we will need thicknesser, and we will need circular saw. In working with those machines, we will need PPE, like air protection, security shoes, and tight clothes. And also we need measuring tools. As we are going to work with trim saw, we are going also to use pencil for marking rough dimension. Measure and mark where you want to cut. Make sure that working piece is touching on fence of table. Hold the machine with both hands.
You have first to check side with concave, then the concave side should be laid on the table of machine. Hold piece with both hands and you have to press down piece, especially when you reach on outfit table of machine. After planing one side, you have to plan also edge. The planned side should be laid on table of machine. Adjust parallel fence according to the size you want to cut your piece. Adjust the well crown guard. Remember to use push stick when you reach nearby saw blade. Now we have finished to produce our pieces, the following is to make panels. In making panel, we need wood glue with, with brush to apply it. We need protecting pieces and we need bucket with water and piece of cloth to clean leftovers of glue. Before you start to make a panel, you have to make sure that the annual rings are not looking in the same area to prevent that our panel can, can bend or bow. As we are going to work with glue, we will need also ramps. Arrange all pieces following the direction of annual rings means that they should not look in the same direction. Mark carpenter's triangle so that we cannot mix pieces that can affect our pan. Put all pieces together.
apply glue on all pieces and you have to put a little quantity of glue. After applying glue, return each piece in its original place following the market carpenter's triangle. Put straight piece of wood under and above the piece to make sure that all pieces are on the same level. While making panel, you have to fix clamps starting on one side until the end of panel. After putting all cramps, you have to clean leftover of the After cleaning leftover of glue, you have to wait between 40 minutes and one hour so that glue can well dry. Now our panel is well dry. The following step is to put it on the final dimension. Remember that when we produced the pieces for making a panel, we, we, we put them on rough dimension. Now we are going to put our panel on final dimension. The final dimension of our panel will be 30 millimeters. So then let's start by, make, by putting it on exact dimension. As usual, we have to respect the PPE for the, the operator of the machine, like air protection, tight clothes, and security shoes. You have to start on good side of panel and make sure that your panel fit with the size of table of machine. Cut panel on final width you need and adjust well parallel fence. When you want to cut in length, first you have to make one end grain straight and then the straight side should lay on cross cutting fence.
Do double check to be sure that what you adjusted in the machine is correct. If it is not correct, readjust it and then cut. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Once again, we have learned a lot from this. As usual, you can find this video on the e-learning website of Uganda Polytechnic for more repetition. We welcome you again for the next session. Until then, stay safe and goodbye. goodbye.